<laughs> Howdy, folks. This is not Homebrew Wednesday. This is Thursday. Thirsty Thursday, as a matter of fact, now that I think of it. Coined by the one and only Pauly Detmertz. I'm diving into a Dean's List beer. This is the Resilient Leprechaun. This is a step back from his normal Imperial Strength Irish Red. You, This version uses chocolate rye for a smooth flavor, brilliant red color. Mm, enjoy. So this is a 5.6% 23 IBU. And it's funny because when you look at the little fella, that looks kind of like Nate Pico you know, in his smaller beard days. <laughs> Let's crack this bad boy open. Using one of my favorite glasses. Oh, that's a nice looking beer. True to Mike Dean form. It is crystal clear, clean looking beer. Look at that. Would you? That is a beauty. I can see right straight through that. No problems at all. I can see through that beautiful. Nice red color. Sun is completely in my eyes right now. I'm a little washed out. That doesn't matter. Uh, oh, yeah. That is a nice looking beer. Nice little, uh, about a quarter finger head. Yeah, I'm picking up his malt right off the bat. Did you say chocolate rye? Some rye? Chocolate rye. I am definitely getting the sweetness um, off those malts. This kind of reminds me of my two dogs, not going to lie. Color and all, looks a lot like my two dogs. I'm diving in. Cheers. Nice. It drinks very similar to my two dogs as well. Um, ABV wise, color, um, whole nine yards. It is definitely smooth. There's no heat whatsoever, but then again at five, 5.6, it's about where I expect it. So no surprises there. Thin. Mouthfeel, I will go there. The I am picking up some sweetness from the chocolate that is way on the back end. Way, way, way on the back end. Oh, yeah. That's a slammer, Mike. Well done. Cheers to you, brother. Cheers to you. I did do a video yesterday. Uh, where I was actually drinking one of Nate Pico's beers. Uh, I'm going to edit that one up yet. That was a homebrew Wednesday. I was trying to do a... Uh, oh, I'm kicking my feet up. I was trying to do editing on my phone, and I have... Uh, it's a new app for that that I need, I need to uh, work out the kinks on that to, uh, to get, get that one uploaded. So we're going to go with this one straight to YouTube. Boo! Straight to YouTube. Uh. SG Port Challenge Round 2 All-Star Round is underway. Most of you folks already got your beers. Yes, you did. Yes, you did indeed. Uh, I My entire hub got their beers yesterday. By yesterday. I know that Brad's hub, uh, today's Thursday, I'm pretty sure that his entire hub it's going to have their beers by tomorrow, probably. So we are on track. Jack, absolutely. 
looking forward to seeing what you guys think of those beers. It's going to be a good round. It's going to be a tough round. Round one was hard. Round two is going to be impossible. Impossible. Quick little deal. SJ Port Challenge. Review cards. Do us a favor. Do not alter those cards at all. Don't change the tabs. Don't move things around. Don't rename it. Leave it exactly the way it is. You just save it. Put your, your data in and then send it off to us. Um, the reason why I say that is that sometimes folks will alter that, that scorecard and it kind of messes us up a little bit. We have it set up to where we have another sheet that we can just take that sheet and actually dump it right into the, into the tally program and it will do all the work for us. So um, please don't alter them at all. And another little piece of tidbit when you're scoring your beers, if you're if you're writing them out, and then you're going to enter them in, you know, at a later date, I do that all the time. Make sure you're entering in the right beers to the right uh, right numbers. Uh, we don't want any we don't want any mishaps. So there, that's the only business I have going on right now. It's Thursday in South Central Pennsylvania. The sun shines and it feels good beating down upon my body. I love it. I got my truck back. I'm happy. I do need to work on these screens in the house because I had a war with the local squirrels. And I would have to say that ultimately I won. No, no, I did not win. I did not win that battle. The only win for me is that they're finally out of my house. But getting them out of the house, they did some serious damage to the house. They ripped up the screens on the back of the house, and they got into the wiring on my truck and chewed it up. The rascals. <sighs> Squirrels. Ugh. Anyways, I want to get back to the rest of this beer and enjoy this beautiful Thursday sunny day. Why don't you guys do the same? Guys and gals, this is SJ Poor, Little Face Bro, and enjoy the fruits of your labor, folks. Brew beer. Brew wonderful beer. Cheers. Here and there somewhere. <laughs>